That's okay. No, I love you. Who wants to go? I'm hurt. You were out there in. Uh... What is here, huh? You were out there in flip flops before, and and then you might have been the most bundled up guy out there. Was a uh, was it really cold or? No, uh, it wasn't it wasn't bad. Uh, you know, I had some extra stuff on me, and and I want to just try something. You know how's how cold it's gonna be tomorrow. So I wasn't very cold, but I gotta I gotta do a little 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 more, you know, little extra stuff for tomorrow. But not too many because I would be too happy. Go ahead, Adam. You've been through this a couple of times already. What's it feel like to go out there in a place like Yankee Stadium? Well, it's a, a special, a special place. That's that's for sure. You know, it's just hit me when we came to the dressing room. Uh, you know, it's something I never. You know, it's a lot of, lot of great dressing rooms, but I never see anything like that. It's, uh, yeah. You don't know. They're so they're so big. Uh, you don't know who's sitting on the other side. That's, you know, it's gonna be tough for the coaches to have a meeting. <laughs> well, uh, you know, if you make a mistake, he probably not gonna find you in 15 minutes. <laughs> that's, 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 a, that's a good thing about it. <laughs> but uh, you know, that's that's a pretty special place. Just to just to, just to play it here, and you know, I'm from Czech, so there's. Baseball is not very popular, and I, I can imagine for some guys who love baseball, it's just it's just to be here. What's the feeling between this and, and playing when you did in the Red Square? What what was that? <clears throat> well, <clears throat> that's a, that's the first time I really had play any game out outside. Uh, said I was a little a little kid, but. You know the, the ice wasn't very good. Uh, you know uh, the ring wasn't very very big. They just did it for the show for the All Star game, uh, and it was it was so cold. Uh, we played in January, I think, in Moscow. Oh, it was it was very cold. This is like a summer compared to back in Moscow. You mentioned about in the locker room the pictures of the Yankees. Being from Czechoslovakia as a young boy, was there any talk of the Yankees? Did you know of the Yankees and the, and the, the players that have played here in the past? Well, during the communist years, we, we didn't really knew anything about sports, or we couldn't even really talk about anything that, that happened in the U.S. or other not communist countries. So I didn't know anything about NHL. Of course, I didn't know anything about baseball. You know, we never really talked. But once I came here. You know, I, I, I follow I follow baseball, uh, I follow basketball, American football. So I've been for already 20, 25 years and 24 years. So I know a lot about it. Let's go, Ira. In uh, recent days, you've been moving up various lists of career numbers and things. But now, when you go into the Yankees room and you see these legendary players, do you have any sense of what your history is going to be and your impact on this league in 25, 30 years? No, I don't. Uh, I, I don't really think about that. Uh, when, when I came to this room, I took some, uh, I took some pictures. Uh, you know, Beirut was there. I took a picture of that picture. Yeah. There's, there's a lot of pictures. I, I look, I look around. It, it's, pre, it's pretty special to, you know, to, to see those pictures about the players you heard about, how great they were. Uh, but about myself, I'm, you know, I. I didn't think about it. Uh, I still have the game. I want to. I want to keep playing. So. I know you have your game tomorrow to worry about, but I'm just curious if you or fellow uh, players were uh, kind, of, kind of intrigued by the game in Los Angeles. You mentioned about summer conditions. Uh, that's really be summer conditions out there. Santa Ana winds. Uh, yeah, that's something you actually ever wanted to play in a game like <laughs> like that. Yeah, you know, if some, if I had a choice to. To play here or LA, <laughs> I, would play, yeah, I would probably choose LA, but <laughs> nothing against the Yankees or New York. But, uh, just, I, I, I think because I had a bad experience, uh, you know, two years ago I got injured in the first period and, and it was the same weather, it was pretty, it was pretty cold and I, I think it's a lot tougher for 
for, for the muscles to get warm up. And I feel like it would be a lot better for me, for my body to, to play in different condition. Yes. Oh God. Just uh, you have another left one today. Uh, <laughs> Jacob. Number four this week. <laughs> <laughs> I start, I start feeling bad. I start telling myself it's probably me. <laughs> or Travis Faggot. But <laughs> so, you Zoom? wasn't there last, last two weeks. But, you know, it's it's not easy for, for players to play with us. Uh, you know, they, they, they've been called up. Uh, we are the liveliest to score. You know, they got six, seven minutes. And next day, you know, they're, they're back in Albany. So, <laughs> uh, I, I, seriously, I, I don't feel good about it. Uh, uh, but, it's, uh, you know, hopefully tomorrow, you know, I, I feel like Joe is a very talented player. You know, I, I feel like he should get the opportunity. And, uh, and hopefully I can, or me and Travis can, can help him and have a good game. You know, it's, it's up to us really to. As much fun as we're all having in here and you guys are having out there, can you talk about the importance of the game tomorrow, the importance of the two points on the line? Yeah. <clears throat> well, we got only 30 games left. To, and it's, not, it's not many, and the, 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 the standing is so... So tight, and you know, any 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 points can make a huge difference. Any victories can make a huge difference right now. And you know, we played a big game yesterday. Uh, we didn't play very well, but we find a find a way to to win the hockey game. And tomorrow we have to make sure we play a lot better than we played yesterday. And hopefully, hopefully win win the hockey game. It would help us a lot, and you know, we would keep. Going up in the standings before the big road trip, uh, you know it's going to be tough, tough three games on the road. You're going to play St. Louis, Nashville, and uh, uh, and, and Dallas. So they're, they're three pretty good teams. So we have to make sure you get some points tomorrow. You mentioned about in Philly with the muscles tightening up, and do your conditioning or your training actually stretching tomorrow change because of what happened in Philly? Well, it's not like I, I don't stretch or, or I don't I don't warm up. I, I, I do, but it's just it's just different. It's, it's totally different. Uh, you know, you are more even if you're more careful. You just never know. I think the the chances something something might happen to me are bigger than in a regular game. That's the way that's how I feel. If I'm right or wrong, I don't know. But maybe it's in my head because it's happened. It happened two years ago. And I was pretty careful today in practice too. I just wanted to just test the water.